Hello everyone, welcome back to another part of Typhoon Wrath of the Tiger. I'm Sparrow557, Jonathan, and in this part, we're going to be doing Pirate Strong. So, here we are. That's another boss level, I think. So, yeah, should be just a boss to defeat, and then, yeah, hopefully this part isn't too long. Um, and yeah, I think the next part is going to be short as well. So, yeah, defeat the Rat Pirate to the free the Crane Master. Oh, 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 oh no, he got me right away. Oh no. Whoa, looks really scary. So, yeah. Reminds me of an enemy out of Kingsley's Adventure for some re reason. And I haven't even played the full game of that yet. I played a demo on when I got that, like. Uh, yeah, I played the demo disc. Um, and I got Euro Demo 106. So. Well, I can't believe, um, like, who would have thought I didn't expect to be talking about Kingsley's Adventure at the start of this, but hey, guess that's what happens. Um, right, let's run around a bit and... Oh, wait, there's a rat here. Can I kill it? Oh, it just disappeared. I don't know if it's even the proper enemy. Oh, you know what? They want you to throw... They want you to throw barrels at them, don't they? That's why they put these here. Well, that looks very odd. It looks really awkward, but no, the stupid rat. Oh, it's got it's got gunpowder. Oh well, actually, he's already got down on health a bit, so that's oh yeah, he can't jump and um do that. So oh, and what? I dropped it because that thing got me. Oh no, what the hell? How did you get these quick enough? Right, yeah, you don't have to hold down circle. Um. So, no, you stupid rat. Oh, but I can't jump with the barrel. So that's why I'm struggling here. Oh, why does that keep thing keep swinging back and forth? Wait, do I go this way then to avoid the rat? Um, uh oh, we want to throw this at him. Right, ah, oh, there we go. That got a ton of health off him, but I don't think you're required to use the barrels, but it'll help a ton. I reckon. No, but we've got a tiny bit. Oh no, wait, he got health back. Oh no. Wait, how did he. Wait, maybe that's. Oh no, wait, was I looking at my health? Oh wait. Oh wait, I'm, am I getting confused? Maybe I shouldn't do that then. I don't know if he got health back or not, but. Yeah. But yeah, why does this rat enemy remind me of King Sweet's Adventure? But yeah, that's a very good game, but yeah. So... Yeah. Played the demo or what? Um, played the demo of King Sweet's Adventure a lot as a kid. But I didn't actually have the full game, so maybe I should do that. No. But yeah. Um, so, we end, funnily enough, that game came out the same year as this. 1999, 20 years ago, so... No, you stupid rat, how the hell, like, these rats keep coming back. So, I don't know what to do with that. I can't jump with barrels, because they'll drop. So what do you even do? Um... Oh, why do those small rats keep coming back there? I don't get it. Uh, can I throw them on from here? No, that didn't work. Um, but he's kind of getting down on the health a bit, so... Um, I don't think I can, I can run with a barrel. Um, no. Wait, do I just go this way? To avoid the rat there? Yeah, I guess I could have just done that. So... Wow, wait, that didn't really... Oh, I see. Right. So when he goes in that red state, you have to throw a barrel at him, I think. I think that's the thing that they want you to do. No. He's just stabbing me. And wow, that's actually... yeah. There's so much blood going everywhere, I can't believe how violent this game is. Right, okay, he's red now, so I think we have to get a barrel. If I'm correct, oh no. Annoying rats. Right. Eh, that, that's just so awkward. It, I don't get why it doesn't go all the way. Like, that swinging thing, whatever it is, I don't know what it is, but... Yeah. Right, so come, yeah, yeah. Alright, yeah. I think that is what they were wanting to do there. Oh, 
Probably wants to um stuff. Wait, I want to use chi. How do you use chi? No. Um. So what? Uh, yeah, is he dead? Right there we go. Yes, victory. Okay, that wasn't as bad as I thought it would be. All right. So I think there's a cutscene now. So yeah, there we go. A great many thanks to you, young master. My people and I are forever in your debt. I'm not yet a master, Felu. Still, your training has seen many hands. The wise mantis, the fierce leopard, and, well, the monkeys, among others. Well, I've come to learn from you. And so you shall. Come, I will teach you the stillness of the crane's flight. After jumping, press and hold X at the top of your jump to hover. Cool. That's what I call hang time. And while in the air, you may launch your combo attack by pressing square three times, followed by triangle. Kick ass! Perhaps if we had paid more mind to our kung fu prowess, we could have better protected our freedom. May I offer you a lift back to the crossroads courtyard? It is a long journey. That's very kind, Crane Master. I accept your offer. All right. So, but it's funny because well, that reminds me of Sparrow, like hovering. So, all right. So now we've got things that drop. That's very interesting. Um. So yeah, now we've got hover. Um. And yeah, I remember this. This game came out um before Sparrow too. So, uh, yeah, um, like it was early 1999 when this game came out. That was a gold coin up there, and so now we've got all these. Alright, so yeah, it's the same thing again. They tell you what to do. Um, wait, can we get on this? No. Just go through the flag. Um, but yeah, this is just the ship for this level. It's not too much. Um,. So, whoa, whoa, what the hell? What was that all about? What? Can't believe that. Oh, wait, but now the green coins are actually gone. That's weird. This time, though, they didn't respawn. Um, so, what? Oh, there we go. Okay, it's weird because, um, like, these were the enemies before, but this is a good one now. That's weird. Oh, there's a wife there. Oh. oh no, 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 what the hell? How did I fall? What? Are you actually kidding? Like, how did I fall off there? Like, that's... That makes no sense at all, because, like... I should not have fallen, right. Yeah, just get this just because. Um... Ah, oh, that's weird. Yeah, so you have to do it, and then just keep going. Oh, well, we did that. Right, level completed. So we got the boss, and they were done. But that's so interesting because, like, there was only a boss, like, two parts ago. So, that's very strange. Like, another boss, only two levels after the last one. And so, yep, yeah, and now we have another move. So, yeah, Crane and, yeah, that's, that's all our moves, styles. Um, so, yeah, that is really funny to me. Um, right, well, we'll save over this. 73, okay, didn't give us much percentage that, that time, but, oh uh, yeah, so that's it for this part. Uh, Pirate's Drunk is done, so now we're, we're going all the way back to Crossroads again, and yep, yeah, I've already looked it up and I know what it is now, and now everything makes sense about this level, so yet yeah, you'll see what happens when we go back to Crossroads in the next part, so... It's going to be like part two of it. So you'll see why we're going back there in the next part. So thanks for watching this part. Hope you enjoyed this part of Pirate's Junk doing that. The boss and the ship. The level. So yeah, I'll see you in the next part for Crossroads. So again, so see you then. Goodbye for now.